name is Aileen Pires and I'm an astrophysicist and this is How Did Galileo See Sunspots, Moon Craters and Jupiter's Moons? So back in the 1600s, the telescope uh, technology hadn't advanced much and um, the magnification of these telescopes wasn't very great. Uh, Galileo did adapt some of the technology that was available and tried to optimize it, but still his telescope had a lot of optical issues and a lot of aberrations with fuzzy patches, but this didn't stop him from observing. But here's a little sketch of what his telescope actually looked like. So he used a planar convex lens, means this surface is collecting the light rays coming from the object, and the convex uh, part of it focuses it. So it focuses the light rays into one point, much more, much like all the optical devices do now. This lens is called a planar convex. And what he did is that he put a diverging eyepiece and then he could see the image upright. And what this does, it amplifies the image. And here's the eye. And this is a diverging eyepiece. With this technology, not only could he see upright figures, he could actually see a magnification up to 30 times. And that's how Galileo, that's how Galileo observed all of the solar system. My name is Eileen Pires and I'm an astrophysicist. And this is what did Galileo use to observe the craters and Jupiter.